good guys welcome back to ron's rides welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where this is it these are the last spy photos you will see of the new ferrari Puro sangue suv before its debut tomorrow this is from gabe tz spy unit as he just posted these photos of the ferrari Puro sangue suv shout out to gabe tz spy unit as i will link his page in the description below so you guys make sure you go check him out because again he gives us the best exclusive italian photos that we can see on the automotive game now after almost four years of waiting the prancing horse is finally ready to show the whole world is new fuv or ferrari utility vehicle aka suv now in the recent days to sweeten the weight the Marinello company has released some teasers that we posted videos on that gave us a listen to what could be the V12 engine that will be under the hood of the Ferrari Puro Sangue, but it could also be a V8. Now, less than 24 hours before its debut, which will take place September 13th, these images are from Gabe TZ, which shows us a few details released so far. Like we know, it will have air suspension and all-wheel drive being built on the same platform designed to house a hybrid powertrain. Now, the spiritual successor to the FF and GTC4 Lusso will use a dual-clutch automatic transmission and offer a four-seater interior with more space than other supercars in the Prancing Horses lineup. Now, recall that Ferrari is lagging behind when it comes to the SUV fashion, which could be a good thing, as this Per Sangue will face the stiff competition from rivals like the Aston Martin DBX and the Bentley Bentayga. Now, McLaren has avoided going down this route of an SUV until now, but we heard that they may be working on a high-wheeled supercar. And the list of high-end brands without an SUV in their lineup continues to shrink with each passing year. And after its highly anticipated world premiere tomorrow, the Ferrari Por Sangue will be in the hands of the first customers due in the first coming months of 2023. So this is the last camouflage version you will see. So now I have to ask your predictions. Will it come with a V8 engine, V12 engine, a hybrid engine? What do you guys think is coming out of the power plant of this Ferrari Por Sangue SUV? And how do you think it will be received? Also, what do you think the launch color will be? More than likely red, maybe yellow, or maybe a gray. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below before we see the Pura Sangue tomorrow. Now, with that said, if you guys want to help further support the channel and enjoy what I do here, make sure you hit the big thumbs up because when you give the video a like, it helps get it up in the rankings where people can see it. And we'll have a bigger discussion on the Ferrari Pura Sangue last camouflage photos before its official debut. Now, with that said, if you guys want to help further support the channel and enjoy what I do here, make sure you check the links down in the description below where I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, my Cash App, my Venmo, and my Patreon, just in case you guys want to donate an extra dollar or two to the channel. I appreciate the extra love you guys give and show. Thank you so much. You guys can also check out the Ryan's Rise merch. You can get t-shirts, stickers, tank tops, hoodies, everything Ryan's Rise is there. And I'm also on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. See everything I'm posting, Ferrari, Maserati, Alfa Romeo, and Fiat that doesn't always make it here to the channel. Now make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, you guys be blessed, have a great day, and we will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise video. Peace.